The president's proposed border wall isn't just dividing two countries, it's creating divisions between Texas Republicans. Good evening, I'm Katie Orth. And I'm Eddie Flores. The House of Representatives voted against the president's emergency declaration today. Out of the 13 Republicans who voted in opposition to the emergency, one of them is from our area. Big Two's Caleb Califano had the chance to speak with him today, and he has more from Upton County. President Donald Trump has declared a national emergency to fund a border wall. And Congressman Will Hurd is the only Texas Republican to oppose it. And while many of his constituents believe it was the right decision, others, like right here in Upton County, believe he's not representing them. It was just last month President Trump declared a national emergency to fund a wall on our southern border. Talking about an invasion of our country with drugs, with human traffickers. The announcement caused a stir in Congress with the House recently voting to rebuke the national emergency. 13 Republicans voted in opposition to the president, including Congressman Will Hurd, who believes there are other options besides a visible barrier to stop illegal immigration. We have to have the technology available to detect a threat, assess that threat, track that threat. He also tells us this declaration of a national emergency is problematic and that he doesn't want future presidents to possibly take it to the extreme. My fear is that you're going to have a future president tell you you can't drive a truck uh, because of the CO2 footprint. He has basically turned his back on uh, the people that elected him. So Tammy Smith is the Upton County Republican Party chair. She disagrees with the congressman and believes a physical wall is needed at the border. This is happening in our backyard. This is a national emergency. We're faced with uh, the large amount of the caravans. Smith says this is a concern that she brought up to the congressman just a few weeks ago, in agreement with other Republican county chairs in the district. But Heard tells me constant communication is the only way to get his message across. It's real simple. Do the right thing and explain to people what you're doing and why you're doing it. You know, that's what I do. That's why I've crisscrossed the district as much as I have. Now, the congressman does believe in more urban areas a border wall can work. However, here in his congressional district, which is mostly rural, he says that more boots on the ground for border patrol is what's truly needed. In Upton County, Caleb Califano, Big Two News.